again and welcome back to our channel. Hang uh, on a second. Happy holidays, everybody. Happy holidays. Uh, yeah, we're leaving Oliver. We are heading for Denia. First of all, to a supermarket, then we'll decide where we're going to stop. And we're going to try and get one for free tonight for a change. Uh, this one just cost 36 euros, which worked out to 31 pounds 25 something like that yeah a bit 30 euros more than i wanted to pay but that's just the way it is i'm afraid yeah. and we've if had it's a... up to me i'd have done it all three yeah but we've had a few chill out days which is good um and we are definitely trying to find one for free tonight to experience that uh yeah, yeah so... vehicle reversing vehicle reversing vehicle yep. still reversing up, vehicle reversing it feels absolutely boiling it's according to the truck it's 23 degrees yeah it's uh, and it is half past 11 so it's uh, very 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 warm yeah so uh i'll uh, show you where we are when we get there happy only you can't wax spain people it's amazing it's awesome i love the bus yeah we're loving it <laughs> absolutely loving it a merry bloody christmas I must say the weather is absolutely stunning today. It really is. And it's only going to get hotter apparently for us lucky people that are in Spain. You can't whack it people. I know I keep banging on but you really can't whack it. If you haven't done this you really need to give it a try. Are you telling about the oranges? Yeah. Oranges everywhere. No, you're telling me add a couple? Yeah, because uh, we wouldn't take them off somebody's land but you find like People have shut down business, and but you, find, you, you find the odd tree here, here and, and there, there, like you know, yeah. derelict ground. So yeah, yesterday we picked up first time we've ever done it. Picked oranges from a tree, and, and, it's, it's, and they were absolutely amazing. Yeah, absolutely, honestly, best orange I've ever had. Yeah, and they were and free. I'm 28. <laughs> and one thing that I'm surprised to see and it must be legal over here because going along this main road or any any of the road main roads that we've been driving along you come across prostitutes just sat on a corner on a stall in the middle of nowhere it's just uh, very bizarre we keep passing them and uh, they keep waving i'll keep tapping the horn <laughs> unbelievable yeah it's uh, i just one thing i never Expected to say that yeah, uh, it's it's, uh, it's got to be legal, surely. I don't know. Answers in the comments if you do know. Not that we're that interested, but <laughs> <laughs> they are some of the girls. What we've just passed one, she looked about 12. Very sad, really, that they've uh, they have to do that as a as living. Well, they've got to make a living, they've got to make some money. Yeah, to buy, uh, well, they don't need to buy oranges. You should never die of thirst over here because there are so many orange trees. I keep banging on about them, but. Uh, and now I've said that, I've just looked around for someone I can't see any. Not too sure what those mountain range or hills, whatever they are, but they are spectacular to look at. Just like me? Yeah, oh, there we go. Hang on. And there, if you can catch them, are the orange trees. They, But they are literally everywhere. There are, I must say, very dramatic, it's very dr dramatic scenery as we're uh, travelling absolutely beautiful but I uh, we wouldn't have seen that if I hadn't have done a miscalculation just so instead of taking 15 minutes to where we were going to it's now taking us 30 because I said to get off the road when we shouldn't have done you happy? no all diesel one burnt away it's a good job it's a bit cheaper over here but that's part of the fun isn't it in Spain, you've got to make a few mistakes. Oh well.
We've found this park up. We're still driving towards it. Well, people, we have found a perfect park up. We really, really have. Absolutely stunning. Doesn't look it from your angle at the moment. Well, actually, it doesn't look too bad. Yeah. But when you see our view... And apparently you can stop here for 20, 48 hours? Well, it's, uh, we can't work out if it's 24 or 48, yeah. but, we, but you can't return after seven days. So we're only going to stop here tonight and then move on to Benidorm tomorrow. But what a view we've got. Yeah. Let me and show you. Free. And it's free. That's the main thing. It's free. I like a bit of free. There you go. So we're all parked there. Oh, it's absolutely stunning. All for nothing. You can't whack it. Yes, absolutely perfect. Apparently, well, there's a marina down there, yet another marina. But apparently, Denya's down there, we think, so we're going to jump on the scooters and see if we can uh, pop into it. What another cracking place, people. It really, really is. We just got the scoots out and uh, decided to have a, a little look round. Yeah, uh, to be honest, the, uh, the weather makes hell of a difference, as you all know. I mean, not rubbing it in or anything at home, but it's only... But I've got a t-shirt on and I've got shorts on. And it's only... And I'm happy. It's only 21 degrees. <laughs> 21 degrees in December, man. Yeah. Amazing. Very, very happy with that. It's actually went up to 24 on the way down here. Yeah. Yeah. But we're by the sea now, so... Yeah. Yeah, and it's stunning, again. Just like me. What, with all those bites all over your face? I know, man. I've got bloody Pinocchio, I've got bites everywhere. Yeah, stunning. Absolutely. Bang on. Come on, let's crack on. I'm going. You wanna, hang on, do you want to hand up on Shut that scooter? Up, Robert. Huh? Shut up, Robert. Yeah, so as far as you can see over there, following the coastline, we have come all the way around that, around there, around there, and up here. And we have just found a motorhome. Whether you can park there overnight, I do not know. I would say not overnight, probably just in the daytime. Yeah, but he looks like he's been there a while. Why is that? I don't know why, I just... He doesn't. Not the else on them days it's again, just, folks. It's just thought there. <laughs> I ain't saying nothing, I'm off. And then it brings you up to another cracking marina. So we'll just follow it round a bit more and see where we where we come. Yes? Yes, sounds like a plan. Will you take photos of me? No. Pretty boats. Unbelievable. Yeah. Perfect for scooters, perfect for e-bikes, perfect for any kind of bike. Perfect for walking. Yes. Be that way inclined. And then you come to all the bars and the restaurants, which stretches on for quite a bit, I think. Yes, perfect. Nice boats down there, brand new I'd say. That's worth a few quid. So I don't think I'll be having one of those. Just over there, there's a massive ferry, so this place must be a very popular place here in Spain. Marina di Denia. Which means Marina of Denia, or Denia Marina. Hang on. That is of. Hang on, I was just going to say that. Of course you were. And then you butted in. Whatever. Unbelievable. Whatever. Now people, I know this is a, a motorhome channel, but I've got to show you this. Check that boat out. I can't get any closer because you're not supposed to go in there and there's a guard up the top there so I don't want to be shot. But look at it, absolutely stunning. 
we've got a little speed road on the back look that's money people that is definitely money I would say this place is definitely a multi-millionaire's playground that's what my little angel just said didn't you? I did you've got to have some money to stay here the boats are worth an absolute fortune yeah you wouldn't leave me would you for a bloke who owns a boat like that well I've been standing around here waiting for someone to come but <laughs> No offers. Unbelievable. And there is bar after bar after bar. Restaurants. You could even get a yeah. What's it called? What's it called? It's got a right out to be a jet ski. You can even buy yourself a jet ski if you want one. All the way down. Beautiful place. I don't know if the sun's going to get me here, it probably will. I don't want to rub it in or nothing, but the sun is blaring here in Spain. But look at the backdrop to the place. I don't know if the camera's picking it up, but the cliffs are actually white. It looks like the white cliffs are over from here. What a beautiful place. Happy I brought you here? Beautiful, absolutely stunning. And it's the last peaceful day we're going to have for a bit, isn't it? Benidorm in the morning. <sighs> Benidorm, here we come. <laughs> I'm looking. I'm just enjoying the last peace and quiet. You've had peace and quiet since you've been away. You've been with me. Oh, it hasn't been peace and quiet. Tell, tell them what's the matter with you. I've got toothache. He's got toothache. Nothing no worse than toothache, is it? Hmm. But she, this has been going on and off now for about about three weeks. About three years. No, I'm fine. But she's uh, terrified of the dentist, aren't you? All right. Okay. Do, do, why are you just... Just shut up, Robert. You are, though, aren't you? Yes, shut up, Robert. <laughs> well, people, it don't get much better than this. No, I've just got burgers. Sitting here, eating a burger, overlooking... The best view ever. Ever. That we've had. There you go. Watching the sun go down. Watching the sun go down, having a romantic evening with our burgers. Well, can you hurry up, because mine's going cold. <laughs> can't whack it, people. You can't whack Absolutely it. Absolutely stunning place. Loving it. Loving it. And I'm having a snog tonight. No, it's really not. I've still got toothache. I don't want a bloody snoggy tooth. Let's get this down. Let's... Yeah, looks, I don't think picking up on this camera, but it's all, all coming to, to life now. I'm going to turn the lights on because it's getting that dusk. It's dusk at the moment here. Beautiful. So we're just going to walk up the other way now, people. We've been down by the marina. Yeah, we're just taking maybe some walk before bedtime. And yeah. she's just stopping for a wee. There she is, look. She does do that. She doesn't care where she does it. A bit like Lynn. <laughs> Unbelievable. What a beauty, it's still about 18 degrees. Yeah, and apparently there's about, what, 20, 20 miles of... Uh... 20 kilometres of sandy beaches and coves, and they get 3,000 hours of sunlight per year, and it never really dips below 20 degrees. Man, that's mad, isn't it? Yeah. You've caught sun. No, I haven't. Seriously, you have? Well, I've been trying. Oh, you've got your tough eggs playing up again. Oh, it is. <laughs> Lynn's getting a bit worried because uh, some bats flying about. No, I'm not getting worried. It's just we see so them a lot. So it's a good job you've got your man with you and you we, to protect we, you and look after you. We do see them a lot at the static uh, in a, on a summer evening, but when it's dark. Yeah. But it's only dusk here and there are bats flying around, which yeah. is wonderful. It's a shame we, can't, we couldn't pick it up on the I camera. I've got a, a six foot wing, wingspan. Shut up, Robert. Not bats, are bloody pterodactyls. Don't be scared. I'm not scared. Oh, come here. Beautiful here. Just like me. And now the sun's gone down, the wind's dropped. Yeah. Because it was a rather windy earlier. Yeah, but it's really nice now. It's really nice and mild. Even though he's got a fleece on. Even though I've got a fleece. Bloody hell. <laughs> no, when you've been out in the sun all day, you tend to go a bit chilly at night, don't you? That bin's here. That's good to know. Oh, yeah. Bins. Got bins. Happy with that? Yeah, it's getting a bit dark now, so we're just trying to get as much in as we can. 
I mean, even the rocks, everything just looks fantastic at this place. Denny. I hope I pronounced it right. I think it's called Denny. Is it? Am I pronouncing it right? I think so. Yeah. Bloody face is driving me mad. Got lumps and bumps everywhere. <laughs> That's your age. <laughs> yeah, bloody bites. I'm taking antihistamine every day. I stopped the little buggers biting me though. No, but you are using smidge as well. But yes. every everywhere we go, wherever we've been, all over the world, he gets bitten by something. Yeah. Always, uh, most of the time uh, when we're away, like Lynn just said, I end up going to hospital and having an eagle up my backside, which he quite, finds quite funny. I do. Everywhere, everywhere we go. Unbelievable. Uh, you walk. We've just walked up the uh, the other way, and then obviously you come. Well, I don't know what it is. Houses, maybe. Or maybe it's a restaurant. Well, I think it is a restaurant. There's tables and chairs in there, I suppose. So it's got a good chance in it. Yeah. Did he bat? I don't know if he picked that bat up there on the camera. He just attacked me. Yeah. Apartments over there. I think they are. Yes. Cracking place. Well, I just presume you can walk for miles and miles and miles. And miles. And miles and miles and miles. And probably into Benidorm. Probably. Yes. If we had more time. If we had more time, we'd probably end up going that way on the scooters tomorrow. But, of course, we've run out of time. So we've got to move on to our next destination. Yeah. Benidorm, here we come. Come on, Benidorm. I'm looking forward to coming to Benny. Are you looking forward to Benidorm? I'm reserving judgment at the moment. Why is that? It's like I said, I've said before, it's not the place I would have booked to have gone to. Unbelievable. Good morning, everybody. I've just jumped up. I've just jumped up. <laughs> it's bloody early. I've just got up, looked out the window, and the sun is starting to come up. So I've got to show you this. I've got to rush out and show you this beautiful. And can I just say, we have had a cracking night's sleep here. No noise. Perfect. All you can hear. Is a little whisper of the waves. Lynn got quite romantic. There again. No, she didn't. <laughs> Lynn's not talking to me, people. I've cocked up yet again. Because I've just found out it's our wedding anniversary. Completely slipped my mind. I haven't even got a card or nothing. She's not very happy. So I've got a plan to cheer her up a bit. I'm going to do something for, for the first time in my life and try and be romantic. So tune in and let's see how it goes. Knowing my luck, it'll probably backfire on me. I'll crack on. Now, Lynn will be back any minute now. So what I've done, I've prepared her a little snack. You know, just uh, because I forgot a card and she's not very happy. I just hope she appreciates it. There you go, look. Perfect. Could backfire on me though, people, to be honest. I hope not. Can't be being romantic to you, old bird. Where is she? Oh, here she is. Enjoy your walk while I cleaned you? I did. My missus had a, a wee. All ready to go now to Benny. Now hang on before you go any further. Okay. We're you ready. know, because I forgot your card, and it's not like me, it's always buy you a card. Well, I forgot yours, so we're, we're quits. We're even. You forgot me a card? Yeah. We're always trying to bother doing you this meal, then. Well, I've been gone about 15 minutes, so what can you have cooked up in 15 minutes? Come on, come and have a seat and enjoy. Thank you. There you go. How romantic, Sam. <laughs> Unbelievable. Well, that's the last time I'll bother. Okay. You've bothered. <laughs> you haven't even took the tops off. <laughs> Rub them. Well, that's unbelievable. So ungrateful. I'm not nice. going to. I'm not going to bother again, people. Ever. Think it happened. Ungrateful. So on that note, people, we're going to say our farewells. Yep, we're heading to Benidorm now. So we will see you in Benidorm. I don't know what I'm getting all excited about. 
I'd rather stay here with the peace and tranquility, as long as Robert went to Benidorm. Yeah, so next time you see us, we'll be in Benidorm. You can't whack it. So stay safe for the caravan as much as Ted just drifted the sky was holding you. We still love you. We do. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you on the next one. In a bit. Mm -hmm.